Yo guys, good morning, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to the weekly vlogs. The weekly vlogs have been banging recently. I put one live yesterday. It's gone down a treat, so that's really good. I really enjoy making these and showing you my highlights. So, sit back, relax, enjoy. We're starting the video off at the gym. Yeah. What are you I doing? I can't believe it. Now no, no, that's going to be on camera, isn't it? Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, so we're here with a man himself. Tommy T. Didn't have a clue where I was parked. Uh, we're hitting legs. Now, it's, Tom has requested that I don't film. Because no, he trains chest five times a week. So, I'm going to put him for a leg day. Should be a good one, though. Uh, and I might show you guys a little bit of highlights. I wasn't allowed to film anything in there, was I, Tom? Nope. No. No. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we just nailed that leg workout. Tom's first leg workout. In a very long time. And last, probably. Yeah, no, probably. No, but, yeah, it was a really good workout. <laughs> Squatted 120 kilos anyway, so did all right. I did a 3x3 three three on 120, and then it was a lots of high volume, lots of fast-paced stuff. It was good to train with Tom. We haven't trained him a lot. Okay, the last time we trained was the video where I quit my job. So it's it that long ago. <laughs> <laughs> He's still trying to get views on that one. <laughs> but that was done all right. It's yeah. done all right. But yeah, it was a good workout with Cheech. Are we doing anything now or? What do you want to do, mate? I'm up for something. Yeah, well, <laughs> we'll continue watching the vlog and you'll see what we do. No more legs, though. No more, no more legs. Get a button. Happy days, happy days. We got the shoes back, people. Okay, post gym then, guys. There's only one of two places we're going. Starbucks or Nando's. Today, I think Nando's. I'm rocking a two watt battery here. When your meal is free, up the Nando's card. Right, team, we've gone for the standard spicy rice chips, butterfly chicken peri tamer. Tom has gone for about a thousand carbs, <laughs> rice, double <laughs> chips, <laughs> and chicken. Tom, you didn't know what a macro was 10 minutes ago. Alright, alright. Yo guys, good morning, what's cracking? Welcome to Tuesday. Uh, heading to work this morning, got a few personal training sessions, and I'm actually gonna catch up with Luke. We're gonna go train at his gym, which was my OG gym, so it'd be cool to go back there. They've had a refurb. It's only a little, it's not It's not a big gym, but I'm gonna obviously take you along. Man's got those city socks on. Yeah, much better in that new size. Very, very comfortable shoe as well. So I'll pick up when we check in with Luke. Oi, oi. He loves the vlog, he? All right. <laughs> okay, gang, we're here with my Luke. He's in all the good vlogs, isn't he? So it's going to be a good one. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, we're going to Portly Park. This is where, this is the, probably, this is the second gym I ever went to and I had a membership there for about six months. <laughs> when I went, there was no squat right, nothing. Like, there was no legs, it was a bro split sort of gym. But it's like a fitness suite, in it, when I went. They've just refurbed it. Luke's a member up there, because you get a discount price, don't you? So, it was we're gonna go up there, see what it's like, go take a trip down memory lane, and I'll probably film a little bit for you, and yeah, show you a little bit. That's your pool day boxed off then. Flukey, once again, battered him. Battered Treacher yesterday. Flukey, today, how are you feeling? Uh, a bit sore, mate. Already? Sore. This has changed so much. So that all used to be a golf course when I come down here, I remember. Uh, the refurb gym's all right. It's got the equipment you need to make games, but it's not ideal. But we, we made it work, didn't we? So yeah, it was, it was a good session. So we've got to walk. Feels what I'm doing to 
So guys, that was a really good session with Luke. Like I said, it was weird to be back in that old gym. The Obviously the layout and everything's changed, but it's still the exact same room and stuff. And that's sort of when I first ever got properly into fitness. It was a bit of a bro split, but that's when I started watching fitness YouTube and stuff like that. So it was weird to go back there, but yeah, it was a good session. And what I've been doing recently, and I've really been enjoying it, is going to different gyms and trying out different equipment and uh, training at different places and getting used to different atmospheres because that sort of gives me, that's one of the ways I get motivation from pushing myself into sort of different atmospheres. So if you're in a bit of a plateau with your training or where you're going to a gym, try out different places in your local area just for one-off sessions because you'll find spikes of motivation and stuff like that. So yeah, that's what I've been doing and that was a really good session today. So now, I'll walk in the golf and I've got to make a decision whether I'm going to go in and play Call of Duty for the next few hours before I go to work or I'm going to head to Starbucks and get some editing done and some paperwork. Call of Duty, editing, I don't know. Right guys, so we're checking in today and we've just had two deliveries. I've had a personal training all morning and then the second delivery is what I've been working on. The first one is just a my protein delivery. First time trying out my pre 2.0, I went mango fruit, mango fruit, mango and passion fruit flavour. So anyone had that, let me know. I'll probably have a bit of that today. And just some creatine, because when I get back on my cart, I'll probably start taking this again. But this is the exciting order. So I have picked up a load of hoodies and jumpers and stuff to be printed on, because I'm going to make some. Uh, sweat tops and stuff for me to wear while coaching and while PT. So I just picked up a plain black hoodie, a plain grey hoodie, and then a light grey crew neck. So I'm going to print uh, my new logo, I'll put a picture on there, on that as well. So that's going to be quite exciting. So I'm going to actually go and see the guys that are going to do it tomorrow. So that's quite an ex lot exciting little project and something that I'd quite like to get into myself with doing a bit of clothing. So yeah, that should be good and that's going down. Now I'm going to meet Al for a coffee and then go and head to the gym. Let's give this a taste test. Scoop of the mind cream straight to the dome. Not too bad. Good morning guys, it was cracking Thursday today and today is a very very hectic day. Few meetings, physio right now, personal training now, personal training later. And it'll take you through the whole day. So we got first stop, physio. Physio done then guys. That was the groin getting fixed up. Back physio tomorrow. But now on to the next thing. We'll go get mum a Mother's Day card. And that's the card picked up. Also picked up this to try for the first time. Oh so simple protein oats. So that's got 9.5 gram, 9 grams of protein and 2.5 fat, which is pretty good macros. So I think I'll probably get on that for the cut. So yeah, now head to personal training. Let's go. Okay, guys, another thing knocked off. That's PT done. Now we're heading to Future Fit for a meeting about social media and stuff like that. So I'll probably actually take you into the meeting and we'll do a little time lapse or something. So cue the time lapse. Meeting finished. That was a very productive meeting, a very, very good meeting. I do, I do like a good productive meeting. So we were just talking about social media and ways we can grow their social media and what I can do personally to help them out um, in terms of uh, the demographic that we're working towards. So I'm going to do a few takeovers for them. I'm going to try and do a monthly video for them. So that should be sweet. So make sure you're following Future Fit. And if you're ever interested in getting qualified in nutrition, fitness, or anything like that. Shoot me a message down below and I'll put you in contact. Okay guys, we're at the next location for today. Sea Dogs Printing Studio. I've been in contact with these guys to try and print some hoodies for me to wear at work. You saw them yesterday. So, 
I'm gonna go in, check them out. They've made a few designs for me and hopefully get some t-shirts printed. Next on today's list, guys. Home to Starbs, the home of the best coffee. Me and Al here, getting a bit of work done, and then heading to the studio. The title of the video has got something to do with the 15,000 calorie challenge. <laughs> because me and Al are thinking about doing it. We're both about to start a long cut. He's going for IB for I'm cutting because I want to look like Christian Guzman. So we're about to start probably about three month cut we thought about doing a food calorie challenge before we start. So I did the 10k one last year, probably the worst day of my life. Alex reckons he fancy it, so I really don't. But I've said, if this video gets 25 likes, we will do the 15,000 calorie challenge next week before my cut starts the week after. If we made a round off, like finishing a bowl, with 15,000 calories. Mate, that's more than my, that's my Monday to Friday bulking calories. Yeah, it's done. Oh, it's hideous. So yeah, if you want to see that. We've planned it already. We have four about it. It's horrible. So, like this video. Go and sub to Al's channel as well. Go and get in the comment section saying get that 15,000 calorie challenge done. Yeah, and we'll do it. <laughs> Yo guys, checking in on Friday. I have just done loads of PT this morning, had a massage, now sports massage and done a bit of sports physio with him and now I'm heading back for a meeting with Mark and then to work. What I wanted to talk to you about, last clip, last clip I think it was, 15,000 calorie challenge, I brought that up with Al. I don't know if I'm ready to do this, you know, it's, ugh, that 10,000 calorie challenge was probably one of the worst days of my life. So I am not sure if I want to do this 15,000 calorie challenge. So I might bail out. I might do some sort of food challenge, just a one that's a lot easier or more entertaining. Give me some ideas. I was thinking maybe like Krispy Kreme's challenge, every minute on the minute, how many can you get through with Alex? Something like that instead. I don't know. I don't know. If you really want me to see that 15,000, do that 15,000 calorie challenge, you better like this video. Um, and I will probably just sign out here because this video is long enough. So if you've enjoyed this video, please smash that like button. Smash that like button for the food challenge. Give me a comment of other challenges, ideas, and I will see you in the next video.